today I'm going to show you how to make a fun little beach chair for a party decoration. It'll be good to have kind of a little bit stronger piece of paper and this is about two inches by six inches. You can make them whatever dimension you want but what you need is three times the width. Fold it into thirds just like that. Now, fold it into thirds with one reverse side. So what you've got here already is the start of the chair, start of the chair. This will be your front piece, and what you're going to do is you're going to cut a little under a half inch. This will be one of your front legs, and the same thickness on the other side, just like that. Okay, that'll be your front legs. Now what you need to do is turn it over, and you're going to fold this down and you are going to, you see, if we would cut the same, it would be here. But what we're going to be doing is making our little arms of our chair. So you're going to cut skinnier in, but not all the way to the edge. Maybe stop at about a half inch. So you stop right there. You need a back to your chair. I'm going to maybe make it a little farther. Maybe about like that, about the same thickness of your chair leg. And the same thing here, you're going to cut a little bit inside of what the length of the leg is, or the width of the leg is. And then you're going to open this up. And these get bumped forward. These will be your little arms, just like that. Bring it up, crease it. Same thing in the other side, so it understands you want it to stay nice and strong. And the same thing on the back side, so to be just like that. And how you get the back legs is you're going to make a decorative back to your chair instead of leaving it that of a big chunk. You're going to cut in the width of your legs from the front, which is a little under a half inch. You're going to do a snip in. And then you're going to have to reach underneath here and do your cut. And you may do the cut all the way to that fold of the back seat of the chair. Reach in. Oops. And do that cut all the way to that fold. Now these will be your back legs. Now to strengthen both the front and the back legs, you need to do kind of an inverted fold. And you just kind of have to guide it. This is a little heavier paper, so, and it doesn't have to fold all the way up to the base of the chair, or the seat of the chair. Just enough to, if you invert it, it'll strengthen the leg. So you do this on all four legs. And this would be a nice relaxing chair. You could have your legs coming out over here. This could be one chair. You could also take and just clip this off and just have a normal little chair. And here's our red chair. We'll kind of put that in between. You yourself can have a lot of fun with this, or you can bring your kids out and have them make it. Have a great day.